today we're going to be taking a look at all of the future map changes in Fortnite Season 4. So if you're excited for this video, be sure to drop a like down below and click that subscribe button. I really appreciate all the support. I can't thank you all enough. We are already at 1.08 thousand subscribers, almost at 1.1. And guys, I'm going to be doing my next giveaway at 1.5 thousand subscribers. So please help me reach that goal and I will be doing probably another V-Bug giveaway. Who knows? I'll let you guys know soon. And guys, be sure to follow me on Twitter. There's a link in the description at it's Parker DV. I post a ton of stuff there every single day. So if you guys want more content from me, be sure to follow me on Twitter and also check me out on Instagram too. So jumping straight into it, there's been these rift beacons covering the entire top right of the map ever since the start of the new season. They've been sitting there for quite some time, but every day this weird glow starts to come off of them and it's getting bigger and bigger and it's finally formed the entire ring on the top right of the map and if you guys have never played before chapter 2 then you all have no clue what these beacons are and basically they're from season x of fortnite when these beacons appeared on the map at these different locations and it actually brought back the og location so like retail row in season x was like the futuristic one and it actually brought back the original one but it added like zombies to it so anytime these old locations return something else is different with them either you know it could be zombies it could be low gravity no building allowed like we saw in tilted town so definitely expect a huge change in the upper right hand corner of the map but there is something different about these beacons they were actually created by tony stark because it does say stark industries on the side of it so tony stark definitely is trying to change something thank you to hypex for this tweet it says in 14.0 which is the current version of fortnite we are in junk rift variants got added this could be just for testing and they're tied to pois and times so basically what this means is you can see the picture that was found in the files it says red junk rift anarchy acres is next to it oh my god that is an og location way back in season one like when the game first came out anarchy acres was part of the map so i was able to land there and i really want to go back to that so that's pretty cool blue junk rift beachy bluffs okay you guys probably have never heard of beachy bluffs and it's basically just a renamed of craggy cliffs back before chapter two came out the map got leaked like a couple days before the new season and where craggy cliffs is right now it was actually called beachy bluff so not really a new location there and then green junk rift camp cod and yellow junk rift dirty docks so this might be very confusing to you guys and at first it was for me but i've kind of figured a couple things out so with the start of this brand new season we've got the trailer with all the different skins you know all the avengers skins every single one has a secret ability but we only have the Groot's ball the silver surfer which wasn't even a skin in the battle pass it did just come out in the shop but then there's dr doom he's got his own location on the map currently with his two mythic abilities and then Groot's ball so there's definitely a ton missing because in the trailer you can see wolverine's ability she hulks uh iron man's you name it there's a ton more abilities and i believe each one of these locations is going to be tied to these different characters with their own location because the junk rift is somehow going to teleport them in I'm guessing. My theory is the junk rift has been added by Epic Games as some sort of a simulation of that character dropping down onto the map into the new location because obviously with the junk rift you know it drops random stuff out of the sky so it could be each one of those characters. So that is my theory and hopefully it does come true and also something else to consider guys there's these tony stark loot chests that were leaked in the in-game files quite some time ago at the start of this brand new season and obviously those have not come out yet at the stark industries spaceships with his robots there is like a henchman chest in there but it does not say stark industries on it so there's a reskin chest and i'm guessing the authority is going to be changed into the stark industries building and have these chests in them how cool would that be so that's my theory about all the Battle Pass skins and their new POIs coming very soon in Fortnite Season 4. I think this is going to be insane because Doctor Doom, his location is completely like packed. You cannot even land there. It, the chance of you surviving and getting out of there is so small. That's why I don't really land there. So once these other places are added, it's definitely going to spread out where people are dropping. And there's going to be more mythics on the map, which is going to be awesome. If you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like down below and please click subscribe. Remember, my goal right now is 1.5 thousand, so help me out. So guys, I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.